I'm currently working out, and I know it doesn't look like it, but that's because I'm biohacking. Biohacking is a do-it-yourself form of human enhancement in which people attempt to change aspects of their biology to improve health, performance, or well-being. Some types of biohacking have been around for many years, such as intermittent fasting and meditation. Today I'm at the Biohack Lab where I'm gonna be trying workout machines on the cutting edge of innovation with the goal of achieving the most effective workout in the shortest amount of time. I'm here with my biohack trainer, Matt. He's gonna be taking me through a full workout today. My understanding of biohacking is like, life is short, biohack it. Is that right? Yeah, that's it. Whoa. Are you familiar with any of these? No, not at all. This is like a gym, like 3,000 years in the future. Our first workout is on Carol. She promises to give me the shortest and most effective cardio workout available, delivering an impact of 45 minutes worth in just under nine. So it's possible to get extremely fit in like not much time at all. Yep. Uh, Carol Bag uses artificial intelligence. So that's scary. It's really uh, using some reserve fuel that you have in the body that we use usually, or usually just for uh, in case of emergency. Now we create that emergency. Wow, that's like 30 seconds is equivalent to two and a half minutes. Pretty much. I can get behind that. All right, I'm gonna give her the ride of her life. Of Let's course. go. All the spin class instructors losing their jobs thanks to Carol. Go really slow. Oh. You see, Neanderthal man didn't jog. He either walked slowly, surveying the land, gathering food, or he ran for his life. There's no in between, it's just, it's either you're walking or just, yeah. oh, wow. And filling your lungs, out of the corner of your eye, you catch sight of a shadow in the distance, and it's racing towards you at full oh. speed. The shadow of a saber-toothed tiger, you need to sprint away. <laughs> For now. For now, yeah. We got one more. <laughs> Carol stands for Cardiovascular Optimization Logic. Scientists concluded that the bike can make you 132% fitter with significantly less time investment. So how is Carol different from other HIIT bike workouts such as spin classes? Well, the primary difference is the ability to rapidly empty the glycogen reserves in your thigh muscles. That's what makes the bike so effective for increasing your aerobic capacity. It really puts you in fight or flight there. Yeah, it is. It's really nice because the audio and like the sound really brings you back down. So by the time you get to your next sprint, you can really give it everything you got. It's almost show time. 20 seconds, Matt. 10, nine, I hear him. I hear him in the bushes. Set, oh, ready. there's monkeys. Oh, yeah. Ready? Oh. No. Go, 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 go. Push it, push it, push it, push it. Don't lose it, three seconds. Go ahead. Yes. Woo. Man, this is not an ordinary cool. bike, man. No, that this is, is not. This is tour de pain. I don't know how I feel about her yet. Let it go. Why? I don't know. She's a bit bossy. <laughs> really? Yeah. Do you notice how fantastic you feel. I do. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now you're free to be a human again. What does that even mean? Hey, I, you know, that's that's how they talk. Is she gonna order me a burrito bowl now? <laughs> After this, no. Present to yourself. All right. First time in, I mean, on Carol. Yes. Oh. Moving on to our next exercise. Imagine getting the best workout of your life without breaking a sweat. Peak performance training will get you fit and healthy while cutting down on gym time and deodorant. We're gonna use the Vasper. It's really, really good to build muscle, yeah. uh, muscle mass, and also to, to recover at the same time. Oh, that's cool. So that's a lot of it's fun. Like, it's like natural trend. So we send cold 46 degrees on the seat under your feet. So you're gonna have to be barefooted uh, in the cuffs and around your neck. Free so I'm not gonna sweat. That's the purpose. Oh. So heat is the first signal for your brain to understand that you do a workout. So we trick your brain not to understand that you do a workout while you train. At the same time, we have the cuffs that are doing blood flow restriction. Yeah. So the purpose for that is to build up lactic acid in the larger muscles. I know it's kind of weird. This sounds extremely anabolic. Yes, it is. Wow. These people used to uh, do training equipment to put in rocket ships. And Whoa. this very machine is built up and assembled over there in the NASA site in California. So wow. they know a thing or two. Oh, it's like sitting on an ice pack. Mm -hmm. It's reminding me of my vasectomy days. Can you build like large amounts of muscle on this machine? Yes, and we have studies showing that. Oh my God. 
It's kind of intimidating because it's like if it gets hard, I kind of have like I have like no escape. No. Like you're tying me up from everywhere, even my neck. Yep. Is this supposed to like choke you a bit or no? No. No. Whoa. What I'm looking for right now is just to make sure we don't lock any joints. That's true. Check your heart rate. I'm gonna put that on your arm here. I'm like dripped out right now. We're gonna do burn, baby, burn. Six, Six sprints. sprints. Okay. 30 seconds and 60 seconds. Are you ready? I'm ready. Oh my God, yes. whoa! Oh, it's way cold. Oh, now I know what you're talking about. I told you it wasn't cold yet. Oh my God, so that's you don't cold. have to start yet. Whoa. Oh, that's way colder than I was expecting. 46 degrees. Shrinkage is already happening. Stay between the two yellow lines for seven minutes. We are warming up. Yeah. We are building lactic acid. Oh, the legs are really burning. You know, it, it kind of is like a, an elliptical knocked up a recumbent bike. Exactly. You know? Your heart rate is staying really, really low. You're not even oh. at 90 yet. <sighs> so now you're halfway in the warm up. <laughs> what? The warm up? Yeah. What's like the survival rate? of like the first time user. Four, three, two, one. All right, same thing. You have to stay between the two yellow lines. You don't have to push it that much. <laughs> okay, but you feel it, right? Oh yeah. Okay, <laughs> perfect there. Keep it going like that. Look at this, you're amazing. You stay between the two yellow lines. You're right in the middle. <laughs> Almost done. You know, I feel like a lot of gym bros watching this, they're probably like, oh, this is so easy. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Okay, five seconds for the sprint. Yeah, get ready. Four. We gotta stay within the yellow line, guys. Let's go. Oh, we're overachieving. Oh, we're dropping fast. Okay, there we go. Oh, is it a minute? Yeah. Oh. Five. Continue. Four. Three. Two. One. Ah. Beautiful. Slow down. Yes. Vasper gave me some some battle scars there. We are two workouts in. I'm feeling kind of confused. I feel fatigued. I feel like how I would after a workout, but I'm not sweating at all. So now you're 10 minutes on the cooling bed, just to make sure your heart rate doesn't elevate, okay. to keep the process going. And this is a little Ooh. essential oil, just to make sure you calm down. Yeah. This is even Vasper, they come with their own essential oil. Wow. Yeah, so I enjoy. Is this a workout too? This is still part of the workout. This is happening with that as well. I'm burning calories. You just don't know it. All right, hit me. Exercise three. All right, so the CVAC now. There's only a few of these in the United States. Here, we open it. Oh, so it's a pressure pod. That window is the same as in a jet fighter. We're gonna basically vacuum the air inside. So it's basically like sending you to altitude and bringing you back to sea level several times per minute because it's your first time, we take you up to 3,500 feet and we can go all the way up to more than 22,000 feet. Whoa, so I can, can I technically say like I summited? Yes, of course. It's a, and you know what? The cold that you feel whenever you go in altitude mm -hmm. is getting so Oh, I'm gonna feel cold. Oh, it's gonna be oh, whoa, so chilly be so in there. cool, okay. So we're gonna take the water in. I'm okay. just gonna leave it open because otherwise it would blow up. Oh, whoa. This looks like an operational stick. I can like just... <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the stick is actually yeah. uh, from a, a jet fighter also, so... Whoa, fantastic. okay. We're doing walkie-talkies? Yes. Oh, so this is, this is... So we can't stay in communication because you're not gonna hear anything otherwise. What's your, what do you want your thing to be? Biohacker? I'll be Donut King, okay? Okay, no yeah. problem. How do you clear your ears whenever you're gonna, whenever you go in an airplane? I was like... Okay, perfect. So yeah. you can also... Or a bunch of gum. That's it. You want some? I have some. Yeah. Is that biohacking gum? Yeah. Is it actually biohacking yes, gum? Yes, it is. <laughs> You're crazy, there, there, There's no sugar or anything like that in there. Oh, is it good? You tell me. Not bad. Yeah, peppermint. Bye, guys. I feel like I'm like a supernatural kid, like a case study. Like 11 in Stranger Things. Are you ready? I'm ready. Over. Bye. 
Skywalker, they are popping. Here on the red line that goes up and down, you have the altitude. Otherwise, you can see it up there. So right now, you're at 2,000 feet. I actually feel like I'm in the sky right now. <laughs> you go from one minute feeling like completely normal, and then the next minute, you feel like you're breathing through a straw while doing jumping jacks. Oh! Thin, but my determination is thick. It sent me out there. It would be too much for your ears. You have to get used to it. Okay. Ooh, welcome back. That was crazy. Isn't it? I feel like I was not even on Earth. When we remove the air inside, your diaphragm doesn't have the choice but to open. Mm -hmm. So we increase the lung capacity. Yeah. So it's like a breath work, basically. Yeah. I think at the beginning though, like a lot of people probably get pretty stressed out because like, uh -huh. oh my God, like my ears are like so jammed and then you're like, <sighs> but like again, you just have to like kind of just let, let it, it happen. Thing. Let it happen. Yeah, let it happen. So Matt's going to show us what the chamber looks like at the highest altitude, right? Yep. And you said it's about to be smoky in there? Yeah, we're going to create a cloud. Right here, it's happening. My GoPro just moved. Did you see it? Yeah. I want to go in right now. Send me in. Oh, you, no. you, would I die? that would hurt. Would I die? No, you won't die. Oh, you see the seat moving? Yeah. <laughs> For our next exercise and likely the most difficult, we had to quickly go to a different lab to check out the ARX trainer, which will show us how to achieve the perfect rep. And I must say this machine has some pretty bold claims. If I want to do a full body workout, how long does that take? You could get it done in 12 minutes. 12 minutes. 12 minutes and you won't want to do one more set. That's hard to believe. So you work out once a week for 12 minutes. Yep. And you're maintaining, look at this guy's arms. What's it? <laughs> oh my God, okay. It's literally going to adapt in real time to the force you're giving it. It's always gonna win. You're never gonna beat this machine. So we'll okay. split up the upper body a little bit. Um, you wanna hit calves as well? What do you think? Uh, I think you're good. Yeah? <laughs> okay. Thanks, man. Dude, this is so cool, man. <laughs> So we're gonna set that range because when you're really pushing, the seat's gonna compress, um, your bones are even gonna compress a little bit. So we don't wanna lock you out. This is where you're gonna push as hard as you can in three, two, one, push. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 push, 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 push. There you go, there you go, there you go. All right, now it's gonna come back at you and you're gonna resist. Resist, 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 resist. Let's go, come on. Come on, there you go, there you go. There you go. So now it's gonna give you a pause and let's go. Fire it up. Let's go. Push. 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 Holy shit. Keep resisting. Keep resisting. That's it. That's it. And I want you to max out this time. As hard as you can. Come on, push, push. Okay, you beat your last rep. Keep pushing. Keep pushing. Hold it. Push, 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 push. That's it. Oh bro, that's, that's only five reps? Or four <laughs> reps? Four reps, halfway what? there, baby. My chest is fucking pumped. <laughs> oh my God, guys. I'm failing so miserably. <laughs> Come on, it's just eight reps. This is the one set. Come on, <laughs> you got it, you got it, bro, you got it. <laughs> this is a joke. Oh. There you go. There you go. That literally felt like I just did an entire bodybuilding chest workout. Yeah. Like I'm serious, like how, how pumped my chest is right now. It's crazy, <laughs> it's crazy. God. You're literally getting the perfect activation. Like I can't, based on how strong like you I'm are. Like, I can't even like, <laughs> oh my God, dude. So is that pretty much like me benching 283? That's you benching 283. And then me controlling 373 on the way exactly. down? Exactly. Whoa. Exactly. <laughs> and then on the eighth rep, I was benching 53 pounds. Wow. Yeah, so that's where the fatigue sets in. Give you a little two second breather between, and it's gonna start from five. All right. Wait a second. Wait a second, hold on. All right, yeah, I don't know why that did that. All right, here we go, five. Oh God. Four. Wish me luck, guys. <laughs> two, one, and pull, 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 pull. Let's go, come on. And keep your eyes on the screen, keep your eyes on the screen. So this is how much you just pulled, 229 and that's it. Pull, 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 nice, nice. 
Ooh. That was done right there. Bro, my, my lats are gonna like rip off my body. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Pull, 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 pull. You got it. You got it. You got it. You got it. One more time. One more time. Let's go. Everything you got. Everything you got. Fight, 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 fight. Average time per set, minute 38. That's crazy, dude. Yeah. That's like, now I can see where you get like the results from for once yeah. a week. For once a week. All right, so you ready for the leg press? No, can we skip leg day? Yeah, for I'm sure. I'm the first biohacker to skip leg day. <laughs> Look at this, they have an eject button just in case. It's that difficult, just in case things go south. I've never been more nervous to curl in my life. <laughs> Are you feeling pulling you? Yeah. Okay, quite a bit. Pull, 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 let's go. That's it, that's it, let's go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. And hold and now resist, resist, resist. Let's go, let's go. Keep the tension, keep the tension, come on. And get ready to pull, 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 pull. That's it, pull, 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 pull. And now fight, 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 let's go. Let's go. Pull, 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 pull. This is harder than a squat, man. <laughs> You're not a man unless you've thrown up from a set of bicep curls. <laughs> oh, fuck. And slow and controlled, slow and controlled. Uh, there it is, there it is. Oh my gosh, And get ready to pull. Come on, bring it up, bring it up, bring it up, bring it up, bring it up. Let's go, come on. Fight it, fight it, fight it, fight it, fight it. Nice job. Can you lift your arm? <laughs> How is that only one set of eight? Right? Total time exercising? Six, six minutes, minutes and 50, and 50 seconds. seconds. Four sets. Wow. Average time, minute 40 but per set. That is insane, man. So After a day of biohacking exercises, I thought it was only fair to biohack my recovery, to really maximize the entire workout. We're gonna use the biocharger. Whoa. You know what this is like? It's like, if you like walk into elementary school science class, yeah. and you see this and you're like, you just know the class is gonna be a banger that day. Yeah. This kind of reminds me of that. In average, American people are spending 95% of their time indoors in order to fight inflammation, to have everything in check, actually. We, we uh, piezoelectric beings, we need electricity in order to function. It's like a bonfire, actually. So, so a bunch we, of people can just kind of... Oh yeah, we usually have like parties around it. We have... Yeah. Uh, oh, biohackers are kind of weird. Yes, no offense, are. Matt. <laughs> yeah. You know, you even know it too. <laughs> yes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there you go. Look. What? Athletic recovery. Oh, there we go. Say yes, and it's gonna start. Whoa. You know, we're like we're like iPhones, and it's a wireless charger. Right now. Do you want to see what's happening for real? Yeah. Here. What am I supposed to do with this? This is to show you how the electricity is traveling from there and go inside your body. Okay. So that light is not wired to anything. Inside the body is getting lit up there just the same way. What you're gonna feel is really a sense of comfort. You don't feel that much, but yet it's happening. All right, have a seat. Okay. The brain tap is uh, using guided meditation. And so for you to have an idea how it works, it's using binaural beats. It's sending one frequency to one ear, another frequency to the other ear. When they tune it inside of your brain, they basically tune your brain into the very frequency that we look for. At the same time, we have light to calm down your nervous system. And at the same time, you have guided meditation. So somebody is telling you how to get there. This one, you can just put it on your head and I'm gonna pick the program for you. I just wanna say, Matt, you've been the best biohacking trainer I could ever ask for. Thank you for that. My pleasure. That's the program, Think Like a Champion. So after the workout, this is exactly what you need. You're gonna be there for 21 minutes. You all right? All right, man. I'll see you in 21 minutes. There you go. And I'll see you guys in the next one. <laughs>